just two frogs in this area. So Spot, what's the last one you want to find? Our last frog to find, is a desert rain frog. Take a good look at how it looks. Okay, let's see if we can find it. It's got to be one of these frogs. Do you see the desert rain frog? Right there! Yeah, that's the one. That's the desert rain frog. Amazing, isn't it? Very amazing. What's there to know about them, Spot? The thing I know about the desert rain frog is that they're a plump species with bulging eyes, a short snout, short limbs, spade-like feet, and webbed toes. On the underside, they have a transparent area of skin, through which its internal organs can be seen. They can be between 4 and 6 centimeters long. Wow, that's really good to know. Boy, lots of great frags around here, and lots of great stuff to know about them. Don't you think? Looks like we found all of them. Thanks for helping us find them. This frog book really is great. Lots of great frogs around here. Now if we could just figure out what Spot likes about them. Well, you only have two clues, and you only have one left. Come on, let's go. A clue! A clue! You see a clue? Here in the frog book? Where? Oh wow! Look, Elmo and friends last clue, is a frog. Boy, lots of frogs today. Well, looks like Elmo gets to the draw the clue, in his handy dandy. Notebook. Notebook, right. Elmo will draw two circles for the eyes, an oval for the body, then the frog's legs, the hands, two dots for the nose, and a curve like this, for the mouth. There, a frog. Hey! That's Elmo and Friends last clue. We have all three clues to figure out what Spot likes about frogs. Elmo and Friends are ready to sit in our Thinking Chair! Thinking Chair. Come on, 